So we're back out on the footpath job and in the two previous videos on this job we discussed how to work out the formwork to go around the job and the pegs that we need. We also looked at the reinforcement that we needed to uh, reinforce the concrete and in this job, this video we're actually going to look at how much concrete we need Oops. to... let's go back to that one how much concrete we need to actually pour this uh, this footpath. So as always, great idea to start with a sketch and because we're going to do concrete, we're going to use volume and the way we work out volume is we need three, three um, measurements. We need the length, we need the width and we need the thickness of our footpath. All right, of course, there's three measurements go into the into the formula. Then it's going to be meters cubed as our answer. So our length is 5.678. Our width is uh, 800 or 0 0.8 meters. Our thickness, making sure everything's in the same um, dimension, so everything's in meters, 0 0.0754, a 75 mil thick slab. Times that all together, that gives us uh, 0 0.340 cubic metres of concrete. Now, it doesn't really matter which way you get the concrete, you're going to have some waste. Either it's going to get left in the wheelbarrow, someone might spill a wheelbarrow, or you know, there's going to be concrete waste left in the chute of the truck. Um, there's always, you need to have some allowance for, for waste. And also, you just may not get your formwork perfect to these measurements. There might be some undulations in the ground, so you're going to have to allow for some waste. So 10% is normally a good waste figure. So we take our 0 0.340 times it by 10% in this case. So that brings us up to 0 0.374 um, cubic metres of concrete. Now, the other problem we're going to have is that if you go to the concrete supplier and ask for 3.74 cubic metres of concrete, they're not going to supply it. They only supply um, concrete in increments of 0.1 cubic metre. So you need to round that up to the next 0.1 of a cubic metre, which would be uh, a 0 0.4 cubic metres of concrete. Now that's a fairly small amount for a concrete truck. Um, so you then have to make the decision whether you're going to mix it by hand or you're going to get it ordered in. They can do it in, um, if you get a Minimix truck, or they could do it as an add-on to another order. Uh, but you'd have to talk to your supplier about that. So, perimeter, oh, sorry, area, start again, volume, length times width times thickness, uh, gives us the amount of concrete we need for our slab, allow some waste, and that'll give you, and then round it up, to your orderable length. And that's how we work out the concrete that we need for our footpath. And that's the job done.